uh, hi guys uh, welcome to my channel for another video uh, if you have not seen my previous video so please check the description and click on the link to uh, see the video um, in our last uh, video uh, we did implement a uh, register functionality to our application uh, in this video we'll go ahead and uh, implement our logout function function so then you know when user click on log logouts and they can uh, go ahead and log out from the system for now we did not implement yet so that's why you see it is still showing so let's stop the project and then implement that logout function so i'm clicking on stopping the project and then i will go to our account controller and from there i'll go copy this and then paste it here and then change the action name is log log out okay here i'll remove this and then type let's make it async function okay all right so here now i'll put it with right and then i'll call sign in manager to sign out the user okay so once we sign out the user uh we need to go ahead and route to our uh home page again so redirect to action and here i'll put uh the action name is index and then the controller name is controller name is home okay let's put a comma here all right so here um what we did so let me run the project again okay uh, uh let it load uh let me go ahead and sign to it again so i click on login login paste loaded here my user put the password so let's check password is correct yes i click on submit and then uh, we have a debug point on uh, login so let's click on com continue let's remove this debug point so we do see uh, we did able to log in so now we'll go ahead and try to log out so i click on log out but i do still see we are not able to log out because uh, we need to add our controller to that button so then once the user click on that button and they can route to our account controller and can come under this function okay so to do that this should we see under login for serial uh, cstml so you, we open it so let's make it bigger so if you see here uh, we do have uh, it's ESPAD identity so we're going to remove this we're also going to remove this first this should be ESP action and should be log out and then this should be the controller not the page so this should be account controller remove rest from here and then once user click log out right uh, they should able to log out now so do save here and then refresh try to uh, log out from our page so i click on and i do see how we now able to log out and swing login so once i clicked on log out what it did it came to our under account controller and log the user uh, from the system okay so we have uh, built the logout functionality to our uh, website so now what i'm gonna do i'm gonna change some view uh, from uh, from our uh, net bar okay so you see it showing white i want to have a view some kind of difference so to do that we'll go open layout page uh, from layout page if you see uh, bg background here it said nav bar i uh, said vg white so let's do bg something like success and then save here and then refresh here let's see what it does uh, you see we do see the chains right away white so i see it's black so i want this to show white okay uh, let's get back to here uh this line is coming from make it bigger this line is coming from here so 
I will add a class here saying that text white okay and then what I'm gonna do I'm gonna also make this text strong okay so that means it will show in bold okay so this is done I also want to change the color of the home button okay here I'll put something you know strong also and then remove this then here put white also here I'll do the same thing okay make it white do same thing here as well remove this make it white let me see the view now I click on save then I'll refresh the page I'll go ahead and make it bigger okay I do see uh, the color has changed for our number so number color is green and then the text color is white but I still do see register and login color is black I also want this to oh, show white so let's go back to our partial uh, view uh, let's go partial view again so here the partial view here what I would like to do make it bigger again then do this okay and then here text is white and then next line so do change the button color for logout right and then also change the color for the text and so we also are going to change the color for our logout button right so we change text to white and then we add a strong um, HTML element on logout okay so let's go ahead and do the same here as well so put it on white again and then do a strong here a strong okay and also do same thing here as well white strong get this out from here and put it here okay now we have changed everything from our partial page so to save go back to our website refresh it and then you do see that uh, text color for our register button and then the login button turn into white let's do another login again uh, go to put the username and password see submit and i also did the text color change for the name as well and also for the logout button so i will also click on logout and it takes us to our login page thank you for watching the video see you in the next tutorial please do share like and subscribe the channel thank you bye